Welcome to the AT197 How To for Voltmeter Challenge Short and Open Circuits 1. Let's go ahead and open up our voltmeter challenge and go directly to our shorts and open one. And let's begin. Okay, we have a circuit here. And these modules here, M1, 2, and 3, are a combination of a resistor and capacitor. So these are the DC circuit. So if this has voltage on it, this is in parallel, so our capacitor is going to charge to the same amount. But what this guy is going to do is allow us to short across it if it's defective. So let's go ahead and start. I usually go ahead and go down here. That is a pretty large voltage drop. That means we have a problem. So let's go up here. That's too much. So it tells me that M1 is probably shorted because we have almost the same ground potential here. So M1 is shorted probably. And yes, Oop, way too much voltage drop. So let's go ahead and check it. Nope. Okay, so we have a blown fuse. Okay, that's a fairly large uh, voltage drop, so we got an issue somewhere. So let's go over here. Okay, and so it looks to me this potential is exactly the same. So I would say M2 is shorted. Let's try again. Oops, too much. Good, good, good. Okay, grounded. That's not good. That tells me that this M3 is probably open. Good. Oops. No power, power, blown fuse. Oops, large voltage drop again, not good. Oops, zero. Okay. Since this one's zero, I'm going to say that M1 is shorted to ground. Good. Uh, too little of a voltage drop. Not good. Way too much voltage drop. We're getting the full amount of current here. We have a ground here. So let's just say that M2 is open. Good deal. Insignificant voltage drop. Reasonable voltage drop. So I'm going to say M3 is shorted. Good. Insignificant voltage drop. Insignificant voltage drop. Insignificant voltage drop. So I'm going to say M1 is open. Seems to be a large voltage drop. Zero voltage drop. Okay. So we have the same voltage on both sides of these guys. So I'm going to say M2 is shorted. All right. We are finished. Go ahead and enter your name. Skip dress storage. Yes, ID. And then you're going to go ahead and print this out to uh, Qt PDF or whatever your PDF writer is. We're not going to do that.